Hey guys, welcome back to some RimWorld as our Orc Tribe. Um, how are you guys doing? Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing well. We are, let's see, you're getting a recurve bow. I have no idea what we're going to do today, but we will figure that out. Uh, Zunlog is cooking. I don't know who our social person is. Social of zero, of three, and of zero, which is fine. Mordrog is going to eat. Uh, Adagol is asleep. We will get you to trade after you're done eating. Uh, even though your social is so low, we will attempt this. Yeah, yeah, you can't talk because of poor health. Look at this. We could sell that gold, and we could get some herbal medicine. Wouldn't be bad. And a little bit more pemmican, maybe? Yeah, that's not bad. Oh, then we would be paying them. Nah, you know what? I think we'll be fine on Pemmican. We will get herbal medicine, though, just in case we need it. And it never help, or hurts to do some trading with these, <clears throat> these local tribes. We do have a little bit over here. This all needs to be hold urgently. Sunlog is cooking. Insect meat rotted away. What is this? Silver. Okay. Uh, these grow zones. Who is our grower again? Adagol. Okay. Just checking. Mordrog, you are downed. Because of... Oh, you're drained from Berserker Rage. That's okay, buddy. We will we'll handle it without you for a while. That's okay. We should really harvest these. That would help a lot. <clears throat> that would be a good bit of food for us. Major break risk. More drug. More drug. You're, you're stuck in bed, dude. Just rest. What do you need? Your mood is going down. You're in intense pain. Darkness. Uh, I would have thought there'd be a little bit of light in there. My bad. Who else is cooking? Ragnast, why are you cooking? Oh. Okay, we'll let Rad, uh, Ragnast cook then. We could actually set these up as well. I'll pause it. Or I'll let it go. Patient. Go to the medical bed for treatment if you have immediately life-threatening. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, who is the best doctor? Adagol. Mordrog. And Ragnast. Bed rest on two. Hall plus. Uh, who do we want doing our hall plus? Mordrog. And probably Ragnast. Everybody can do basic. Wardening. Zunlog. And I guess everybody else could be capable of it. Handling uh, Zunlog. More drug, you could also do that. Oh, well, everybody's everybody's pretty good at that. We'll put you back on two. Uh, let's see. Ragnast, you could be... Who should be our cook? Mordrog? Hunting, you could be our hunter. Ragnast, if you wanted to. Everybody else could do it. Cooking. I think everybody should be capable of construction. Maybe not. Zenlog. Adagal. And Ragnast. You could do it as well. Major break risk. <clears throat> Mining. Oh, uh, yeah, you could mine if you want to. Sure. Ragnast. Mordrog, you could mine if you want to. Everybody can be set to plant cutting. Uh, I think that's good for now. Research, we need somebody on our research, but this is fine for now. Oh look, 
Sunlog's drinking a beer. Cool. Visitors are leaving. Awesome, awesome. We need to... Um, I thought there was a... Yeah, corpse bonfire where we can burn these... <clears throat> we can burn these corpses. Okay, I'll let everybody have their recreation for now. Um, we do need to... Yeah, there you go, Adagal. Start growing. Zunlog is going to start... Oh yeah, Zunlog's going to start doing that. Perfect. Okay, real quick though, before you do that, strip these two. And then you should be able to burn them. Burn corpse. Do forever. Human-like. Colonists, no. We want to bury our tribe members. Come burn these corpses, please. And this stuff, I don't know what the T means. Does that mean tattered? Is that what it means? I thought it would have the D for, like, dead, and they didn't like wearing dead people's apparel. And we'll get that stuff hauled in eventually. It's not really that great. We could trade it. That would be about all we would be using it for. Um, it doesn't really matter all that much. Zunlug is digging in up here, which is awesome. I don't know if we have any steel, so it really wouldn't hurt to mine into this steel so we could make ourselves some knives and clubs and everything. I think that would be nice. And I'm trying to think I would actually like to. I know I said I probably wouldn't dig into the mountain, but I would like to dig in somewhere and build like a um, place for prisoners. Adagal, what's the matter? Are you just hungry? You have a ranged weapon. Brawler has ranged weapon. Seriously? Left click. Does that help? Right click to drop it. Just drop it then. Don't worry about it. We'll let you pick it back up later, I guess, before any fighting. We'll try and get you some ranged weapons. That is such a huge debuff just because he has a recurve bow. Huge. Alright, and we're about to have our second tent up for our tribe members. Let's see if we can get this hauled urgently and get it out of the way. Major break risk. Yeah, I hear you more, Drog. You feel bad, dude. I get it. Awful barrack. I get it, dude. We're gonna get you we're gonna get you all fixed up. We're gonna give you this nice little house here. Get that hold urgently and get it out of the way. I also don't think I want to wear these parkas and whatnot because I don't really like that. I mean, I, I get it. I'm sure they would have had those in medieval times, but like we have these boots, like tribal boots and things like that. I don't know. I, I like those better. I like to think that those are more with the lore, I guess. Is it more drug? Yeah. Here, more drug. This will make you feel better. <clears throat> Hopefully. I don't know. You may not like your little tent. I can't give you any hay flooring, so I apologize. Minor break risk. More drug. Alright, you're starting to feel better. So that's good. Okay, Adagal, you're sewing smoke leaf. That's cool, but who's our crafter? I forgot. Ragnast. So Ragnast, you could actually come craft. And we'll set you to two for growing for the moment. Until we get a few steel knives in case we need them. More drug? What's wrong? Tense pain. Yeah, I get it. I get it. Cooked insect meat. Yeah, life's hard. You know, I also would like to set up a few traps, kind of like a like a thing where they walk in through here with a bunch of those traps going. So I think I'll work on that as well. Um, and we'll probably do a little bit of hunting. But first we're going to work on those knives. Mordrog is having a, a tantrum. I guess he finally finally broke so he's going around punching things which is fine let him let him get it all out I guess yeah beat on the tent thanks Mordrog awful nice of you we have to repair this tent Mordrog you think about that young man and also I'm working on a 
Oh, come on, Mordrog, don't destroy that. I'm working on a uh, small spike track, uh, stra uh, trap thing where we don't have to worry about it. They'll, they'll try and come in through here instead of our doors, most likely, and so it'll be... I'll probably do one up here as well. That way they most likely will get hit by the spike traps and we can just kind of set up a, a defense in here for now. I mean, eventually we're going to work on it better, but for now, that works. Uh, more drugs should come out of that tantrum soon. I don't think those last very long unless I'm mistaken. Get that silver hauled urgently. Oh yeah, and we also have a few knives that's been made. Uh, we have, actually I think we have all of them now, which is perfect. I say we should start working on some winter cloaks would be nice, but I'll, I'll use the cotton. I think I can use cotton for that. Um, war mask would be cool. No longer in a tantrum. What should we use? Adobe bricks? Primitive spear, composite bow, wooden helmets would be nice. That wouldn't be too bad. Wooden plates, how much wood does that use? 35, not bad. We only need three for now. Yeah, and we can work on those as well and let Ragnast do that. He should go to sleep and then do that in the morning. Yeah. Mordrog is sleeping. Intense pain. I know Mordrog. I'm sorry, buddy. You're, you're healing, though. You're healing. No worries. Oh, look, the one guy. He must be going. Yeah, I think he's leaving. We were going to try and see if he would join us, but I guess we'll just let him go. Uh, another time, and we'll try and capture some people. And now we have a bulk goods caravan. Let's check that out. Ooh, more orcs. You know, we haven't really seen any of the um, medieval tribes. Just a second, we'll check those out. Like, uh, I think you're... No, we've seen you. Most of these people are like the orc tribes. I thought there were some medieval people on the map. Maybe they're not. Like you. Are you not medieval? People of the do. Hmm, maybe I'm wrong. There should be some, though. If not, it's mostly tribes, but we also have the other orcs. Oh, look, they have a... Is that a sheep? Looks like a sheep. A yak. They have a yak. How fancy of you. How European of you, sir. Uh, yeah. We should really take this and put it somewhere. That would be nice. Maybe I'll claim it. How far away is it? It's not that far away. Oh, I can't move it though, can I? Okay, I see. I can move you though. Reinstall. Steel urn. A urn. I can put you down here in the bedroom. Uh, but yeah, we have a bulk goods trader. I have worked on a good bit of our security, so we have this ready now. It's not too bad. Um, most of the, I think actually all of the hauling is finished. We're just doing some tilled soil under it. Uh, yeah, so we, we have some security now and we also have a few other things. I think next step would be to put some stone on these walls as well to make it more defendable. Harder to break through a wooden, you know, through the walls. Um, Zumlog, I believe you are our best social. Yeah. And I'll let you go trade. We'll see what they have. Alright, so we have potatoes. They want potatoes. We have light leather. Um, we only have like four pieces of it. We have wood and herbal medicine. And they also will accept gold. Um, what do they have that we could take? Ice blocks? No thanks. Insect like jelly? Yaks? Ooh, I would like an animal. That would be nice. Mm, like a donkey, so we could train it, and then we could, oh, look at that, and we could get all that, uh, we could buy a donkey, so we can ride a, we can ride a donkey in the battle, that'd be cool. I'm assuming we can ride the donkey in the battle. Let's see, hello, donkey. Let's do your training, guard, attack, rescue, haw, oh, we'll do all of it. Someone is supposed to be our, um, our animal person, but we'll set up a zone for the donkey. 
Shrink zones. Allowed area. We'll do an area one. Let the donkey come around here. But we don't want it inside. And then animals set donkey to area one so it doesn't come inside. I guess it can go in the tents, but that won't hurt anyhow. Doesn't really matter. Did we get some of that cotton? I think we harvested some of that cotton. It looks like we did. I don't know if we did or not. Did we? Or, or what happened to it? We did have cotton here, I thought. What are you building? Wooden plates, okay. Did you... Ooh, look at that. Good wooden plates. And now we can wear those. That's awesome. We'll try and get more of those ready. Um, I mean, we don't have all this orcish armor, but we... You know, we're, we're a tribe too, guys. We have uh, <laughs> we have our wooden plate armor. It's almost the same as yours. Hey, donkey, why are you... Why are you up there, dude? Clear allowed area. Yeah, I mean, you probably shouldn't be up there. But we'll try and get that donkey trained so we can ride it into battle. Maybe I'll get a animal armors mod as well. That'd be cool. Well, we do have a huge harvest of potatoes and rice, and we got all that going. Um, everything seems to be going pretty well. I need to finish our research table, and we'll finish our first uh, medieval tech, uh, the medieval uh, technologies, which is just tables, things like that. It's not, it's not too bad. Uh, street lamps, which I think all that would be pretty cool. There's um, other stuff in there. We could try and build our... Um, our like great hall that we'd like to build like right down here somewhere um, eventually I'm gonna try and come off of this and you know build the the fort out farther that way we have a lot more space to work with I just kind of built this quick and easy you know everybody everybody has their startup everyone has their startup so yeah and this is ours I had to make sure the donkey was not going into um, the food areas because he kept eating all the crops um, so yeah and I, I'm pretty sure he can eat grass. I think he'll be okay eating grass. So, And we do all have our wooden plates. Uh, Mordrog is still healing slowly from all this. Um, taking quite a while, though, for him to heal. Uh, we do have herbal medicine now. I mean, we have all of this as well. Everyone has a knife as their sidearm, except for Adagal, who has it as their primary which will probably get him another one so he can have two um but yeah everything everything's going well now i don't i don't see anything about the um i think there's like a um mount mounting spot or something like that for the animals i don't see that in here now i i think all that is though or or all i have to do is just um move the mod order around a little bit, but we'll get that taken care of. Or it may be fine, and maybe I just don't know what I'm talking about. Either way, I thought we had a portable butcher's block. I guess we don't. But, yeah, we'll probably do a little bit of hunting soon, so we can try and get some leather as well. Who? Zenlog? We'll check her out. We'll see what's up with her. Delete that. How long before these... 29 days? Really? I wonder why. Is it where it's so hot in here? We could honestly dig back into the mountain and keep our food storage in there. That way it's a lot cooler. I think that's actually a good idea. We could start doing that. I know I said I wasn't going to dig back in here too much, but it wouldn't hurt to have some food storage. Um, Zenlog, you're very annoyed. I'll just eat that meal and you'll feel a lot better. You're in intense pain. Ah, food poisoning. Makes sense. Makes sense. Uh, let's make sure our donkey doesn't starve. I want to make sure he can eat grass and stuff. But, yeah, I mean, we're, we're really doing pretty well for this episode. I think, I think we're doing, I think we're doing great. Everything's going well. You know, no issues or anything like that. What are you doing? Hauling wood to the butcher's block. Okay. Ah, and Ragnast is cutting that down. Thank you, Ragnast. And that way we can build our research bench. 
Um, yeah, I think everything's going really well, though. Seven Log, you're so annoyed. I'm sorry, buddy. Just do some recreation. You'll feel great. Eight without table. You know, I don't know why you've done that, because we have a table up here. So whose fault is that, really? I mean, honestly. Let's think about it here. We have steel urns. I would assume those do beauty. Yeah, they have beauty on them, so that's nice. All right, and then we can butcher creature and do that forever. What is this? Ooh, silver ore. See, that's awesome. That is awesome. But, yeah, basically all we'll do is we'll dig back in here for our... Oh my gosh, heat wave. Great. Great. We do have passive coolers. Hold open. Hold open. Uh, hold open. Or actually don't hold open. Hold this one open. And we will actually build passive coolers in here. To try and keep this room cool where we keep all our food. And then the rest of these places will be fine because we'll keep these open. So it's not a big deal. Hopefully they'll start building that. Ooh, look, and now we have research. Awesome. And we'll do medieval technologies and we'll try and get somebody. Who can be our researcher? You're a crafter, hunter, and handler. I think that would be perfect. We're, we're not really doing too much crafting, so hopefully you can do that. Ah, dirty cooking area. Great. Great, great, great. I guess it's where it's laying in the dirt. I need you to work on that zone log. It's getting very hot. Zone log, you're getting really sick of me today, I can tell. I apologize. We just need you to get up there and put these together so nobody dies. Yeah, I know you want to rest, but I really... You know what? That's fine. That's fine, don't worry about it. We'll let you rest, it's just going to be extremely hot. And you're going to dig back into the mountain, hopefully we can try and get it a little bit cooler in there. And we'll do this. Try and keep our food in here. We could keep our food storage and we could work on some places for prisoners. But yeah, everything's going pretty well, guys, except for the heat wave. And I mean, other than that, we are doing awesome. So I guess I will leave it at, uh, I guess I'll leave it off here and I'll see you guys in the next one. If you enjoyed, be sure to stay tuned for the next one. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys then. Goodbye. Oh, area revealed. Oh. Okay, before we go, I'm sorry. Look at this. Wow, we have a huge cave. Which is pretty cool because we actually, it doesn't go anywhere. Like, it's just here. So that's really cool. Uh, so I, I guess it's about the same temperature in there. Uh, let's put some wooden doors on it to try and keep the temperature in. But yeah, like I was saying, I'll see you guys in the next one. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Goodbye.